And the Perez Center for Peace and the Dream Organization, inviting people around the world to share their personal dreams online. The vision can be fulfilled through a unique piece of artwork. And later this year, art will, the art will be projected at various locations around the world, in multiple places here in Israel, in Europe, in New York City, even in India. The final destination will be aboard a flight to the International Space Station in collaboration with the Ramon Foundation. With us more to talk about the Dream Project is Sharona Carney Cohen, who is the co-creator of Dream. Talk to me more. Uh, thank you for being here. Talk to me more about the the idea behind this project. What is it you want people really around the world to do, and what is the goal of the end project? So we want people to be more optimistic. Uh, we want people to dream of a better future. Even on the way here, I asked someone, what is your dream for the world 10 years from today? And they said, a black canvas with a red X. And then I said, think further. Think about something optimistic. So then they started to explore additional options. And they said, a world without borders, and started to share more optimistic dreams. So the end goal is to get the whole planet thinking together about the future of our planet and the universe. So it's kind of one piece of art that's comprised of many other pieces of art, right? Talk to me about how that works. So we're collecting 100,000 dreams from around the world. We've already collected 20,000 and artists all over the world will be reading these dreams and creating one final picture together that will be projected in different places around the world. So kind of like a tapestry, right? I mean, mm -hmm. it's from each individual piece, it, it, it ends up being a much larger work. What message do you think that sent? I think it sends that we are one planet and we've definitely learned from the last year that we're facing a lot of collective challenges, so we need to see the bigger picture in terms of the bigger planet. Yeah, we're seeing images of, of this project in years past and kind of how it comes together. It's a painstaking process, but from each individual piece you get this gorgeous final piece. I want to ask about this year going to space. Talk to me more about that. And I mean, you can't have, pe you can't have people in spacesuits placing it down in, in orbit, so how, how is it going to work when this is launched? So that's happening with Rakia, and the second is ready to travel to space, Eitan Stiva, and we can't reveal yet how it's going to be presented in space. That's, that's something we were talking about with our producers. How does this get projected, or how do you put it down? I mean, there's no gravity, so how are you going to actually make this co coherent? So it's a with, secret? with some friends, physicists, and scientists, we're, we're planning something special. So uh, that's kind tuned. of a tease there for, for mm -hmm. some, and when will it be launched? Next year. So talk to me about some of the art that you brought. Are these examples? Or these are examples. So this is an example, actually, of this is my dream that you can hold it up if you okay, yeah, that exactly. I'll be. This was illustrated by Anna Berger. So I work with artists around the world who turn people's dreams and ideas into art. So my dream is that I'll be able to surf one day to Gaza, have a friend, have a beer with a friend there, and come back to Tel Aviv. And, and this is the and this is one part of this larger yes. tapestry as yeah. well. And give us one more if you could. This is about the future Speaking in about space. space, right? Yes. What does this show? So that we'll be able to fly to space as easily as we can just fly to Paris or to London and this is just some of the some of the imagery that we'll see in the future yeah really cool stuff and of course we're all excited to see how this will look literally from outer orbit outer space thank you so much Ronan for being with us and talking more about the dream project and this incredible initiative thank you so thank much you.